I'm starting my house hunting journey and you're going to follow me on my journey. Yes, I think it's time for me to now purchase a home and I just to start it. Like, I get serious. Like, this time I'm serious, serious. Not like, because before I was just like, you know, looking at things. I mean, something so old, I'm like, okay, I ain't for it no more. I go wait a while. But this time I'm gonna be serious. I'm planning to take my time in this house hunting journey. And we're going today to see the first house of this series, honey. Yes, and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take my time in this. I'm not gonna rush. I'm not going to do anything that would like um be a problem because the ac is loud i'm not gonna do anything that like to force me to go and purchase early or so quick or too super fast i'm gonna take my time during this journey in my life and weigh up my options and then come to a conclusion and then make my first purchase like that's what i'm doing i'm so excited like yes i still look good i wanted to come out the house i had a long week of school with two exams a bunch of assignments due and all that and i like i need my break just to unwind and enjoy life right now because with all this going on and i have to be online school like i mean i don't have a problem with online classes really because i'm planning to take my masters online and so just like a little practice on how online would feel when i reach in the master program but yes i'm so excited i feel like this new camera quality this is great i girl look at look at all the focus like damn like i i, I feel good i feel good today y'all liking my locks like these are my locks. Let me get close up. Look at this. This is my locks. Look how nice these locks look. I love my locks. Yeah, so I have my mask in my bag. Like I love these. I, these are the key locks. Well, she called them key locks. And I think they're all like butterfly locks or something like that. But then she got these key locks. I got these done from Lock and Key for $180. And I, these are really good. And it's been like a few weeks now, almost a month. I think next week will make a month. Well, yeah, next week will make a month since I had these locks in my hair. 613 and number four. I <laughs> I wanted to try it out. It looks good on me. I like it. Yes, and as y'all can see, my little jewelry and accessories from Shein and if y'all remember this outfit from my Shein haul all these items from my Shein haul so yes they're too hot to be putting on makeup so we trying to exfoliate we trying to put a similar skin to, to get the skin together but in the meantime but in the between time we got a no makeup challenge like I, I can't I can't it's too hot when it cools down then I'm I'm going to you know resume to put on makeup again makeup cakes yeah, it's been a while since his since he actually poke his head out or say hi because I don't you know what's happening in my videos lately. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no particular reason why. I just wasn't making no vlogs or anything. I was just doing like content videos, like product reviews and stuff like that. So it was even a no making no something about putting me in the video and the product review. Just have my voice and focus on the product. So yeah, but I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm getting a big girl now. I'm 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 almost ever a big girl. I always make big girl decisions and stuff. And this is like another step in my life. I hit 30, so now let's do big 30 things, honey. <laughs> It's so hot. Yeah, there you go. So, currently we are fresh right now. The viewing of the home. It's at 5:40 p.m. to view the home. I'm so excited to you know view this home. Uh, in a way, I don't know exactly where the area is located. It's not like the area I don't want to like invest in. So, oh, that's, that might be a little problem right there. If it doesn't be the area I would like to live, just, I only give myself a little bit of the option. 
benefit of the doubt, actually. The home is actually a three bedroom, two bath, and also one bedroom, one bath apartment attached to the home with a pool in the yard and a shed. So, we have to see. I only feel a little Pyoto on the real estate site, but I haven't seen it in person. I can't wait to see it in person to see how big this is. It seems like an old home. So, oh, sometimes old homes and not so wild does have the big, large bedrooms, and sometimes the bedrooms in the homes are very small. I'm excited about the pool though. And then the, and the accent price is $180,000. So if I could get it like maybe a little bit lower, like maybe if I like the home and I get it like maybe a hundred and seventy-five or something like that, if I really like it, I'm gonna take my time with this and weigh my options. Like oh, I really do. I really have to. I really have to. So if you see me trying to be fidgety and trying to rush and do things and be like, oh, I want this, I gotta get this. Y'all tell me please. Hey Sean, no, this is, this is only the first. Look at all the homes. Take your time. Ain't no rush. So, especially when it comes to my money being spent on these things. So in the meantime, you just had fish fried, drinking some sky juice. It's hot. I feel like they ain't put enough ice in the sky juice because it ain't cold enough. And I don't like my sky juice like that. And now we're getting some pumpkin fritters. Right there, you get some pumpkin fritters from there. I hope it tastes good. We make those. These are bacon fritters. Feels like a little, like a little corn. Yeah. yeah, they had a water feature there before. I mean, obviously it's still there, but it's not. Yeah. Uh, it hasn't operated in some time. Okay, this has a little potential going on there. Yeah. Okay. It's, oh, uh, it's a line, eh? It was um, it was uh, a three bedroom. They they uh, kind of deviated the house, or four bedrooms, sorry, and they deviated the house uh, to make this additional space or to uh -huh. make this a one bedroom apartment. Oh, this is a one bedroom apartment here. Yeah. So you okay. Living, out, living room area here, dining here, and then. Oh, I'm sure that. And oh, that's a great size. Okay, let me see. Okay, let's look. Take it down here. Okay. Oh, this one bad one. This is the bathroom or the one bedroom or bath attached to the home. Let's leave you in first. That's the potential, a lot of potential there going on, I must say. Small though. Small. But it has some potential. Okay, this is the main house. Yeah, so we, we can start this way. And this is where they kind of made that separation. Okay, yeah. okay. So you I see now. Area here. Hi. Okay, that's the kitchen. Uh huh. Okay, let's hit our potential. What do you think? Yeah. First guest bathroom that way. Guest bathroom? 
Yeah. I'm good size. Okay. First guest bedroom that way. Bedrooms kind of small. Bedroom kind of small. More closet space. See the fan. I like the research by you know. Some to that you don't want to. Second. Guest bedroom. It's a guest bedroom. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this size is a bigger. Much bigger bedroom. Okay, this is the mattress. Yes. Okay, this is much bigger. Yeah. The size four, eh? Mm -hmm. oh. I hit a bathroom. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. You can work with that. This bathroom is nice. I mean to work with the like the most the ideal. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I see leaking. Right there. No hey, problem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You put like double things here, one here, mm -hmm. one there. You even could cut this or make it small. Make it big. I'll put a shelf. Oh, I'll stand on the shelf. Okay. Okay. So now it's outside now. Yeah. So again, this was an addition. So we can see here that, that would be the, be the bathroom window. Okay. Oh, right that's the bathroom window. We have the next bathroom window. So again, this would have been put on later. Oh, this would have been on so, later. Yeah. Because they would have lost the living room from, from when they made the addition. Oh, okay. Okay. So there's, so there, there's no punch room, so just like a living yeah, area. Okay. Today. Yeah. So it's just that, that's okay, that's so this is the pool. So you yeah, have pool. And obviously they haven't filled it or maintained it in a while, but the pool still holds water, so it works. Okay. Okay, this took a bath. Uh-huh. Okay. That needs to work. Yeah. I see there's a grill mm -hmm. pit. Grill pit area. They had some grill entrance. Okay. Oh, that's the same for the grill pit. Mm-hmm. Maybe something there. It's a shed. Yes. Feel free to go peek in. Okay. It's a good size area. shed, though. Yes, good size. One area that, that you know, we want to point out to you that you you'd probably want to have your contractor come and take a look at is is right here. It's just a bit of loop on it. I saw just to the edge here. Yeah. But for the most part, the roof is in good condition. So we've gotten quotes on this to get this done uh, that are around two thousand dollars. So it's not it's not extensive. Yeah, right there. Right there. Need to. 
Yeah, so you show sure that only that edge or not the tie because I noticed in the bathroom it has a little right. like, moistness inside. Yeah, and so that's I, I haven't I've walked the whole roof. I haven't seen any any uh, this is a major area of concern. Uh -huh. Um but outside through the other parts of the roof I haven't seen any other issues. Oh. Okay. That could be a laundry. Could be, yeah. Yeah. A laundry room. Yeah, and you can move that mm -hmm. and then put it there because this could be a whole laundry room. Right. Right, there, instead of just having it out. Okay, interesting. Different slip levels. Mm -hmm. Dining area. That's one thing I miss out. Mm -hmm. Small dining area. Get small. Let's see if the first potential. And now, same price is 180? 180, yep. Hmm? Yeah. You could do a lot with that. Mm -hmm. I missed the car. There's only like one car. So we have a spot, no spots. I mean, you could, you know, you could back two cars up on this. Uh, and you have space over there as well. Mm. Well, but that's mostly for the one next bedroom. Yeah, one bedroom. Okay. If you're doing a driveway there, that's for that apartment. Right. Okay, it has potential, right? But that one bedroom gotta go. Because I'm cutting off a lot of space yeah. and I'm making that look pretty jam up. Yeah. That's the problem. How they add on that one bedroom, one bath, and having that jam. Yeah. But that one bedroom, one bath is a perfect size for rental yeah. income yeah. right there. That's a perfect, nice size to go for $850, $900 a month. But the, uh, the living side, that's say if we decide to move there and renovate there and all that, that ain't enough space. They don't even have a front room. No, don't. That's like a living room. You see the different split levels? Yeah. That's a problem for me. I didn't want a home with uh, different split levels. You gotta be. What if you come home drunk as much as we just drink? Uh. <laughs> and be dropping down. Literally falling down. <laughs> Dead drunk. I mean, forget me up steps in our own house. Every section is a step to go down, down, down. I can't be doing that. So overall, what do you think? Overall, uh, would it be something you'd be interested in? I like the backyard, the backyard has potential. When I saw the little cabana, mm -hmm. I said, I could picture you, um, renovating that mm -hmm. and making something good out of that. And that little pool that's a perfect little size pool for us, mm -hmm. for just us. And then your kids, when they come over and stuff, and you know, my little sister and my family, we could have a little something and nice. And I like how they had the sink and that grill pit the back, yeah. on the side. That's still that even give me an idea that you could put a nice modern grill pit there yeah. and a sink a modern <coughs> sink area mm -hmm. and have you know something like that there that give me some oh and then that back shed instead of the washing machine washing dryer how they had it outside like that that could have gone in the back shed mm -hmm. and make a whole wash house in the back shed that, that could generate more income because you could do sell out one bedroom one bath and include a washing facilities with coin washer and dryer and make extra money. Your tenants don't have to go to the wash house. They be right in the premises. Once they have the coins, like quarters, they could use the wash and dry. We can make an extra little income on the side. But it's small. The 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 owner's part. That tiny. Yeah, ain't no front room. It's basically a living room. Yeah, and then. And then the, the main entrance is through the kitchen. Yes. Uh, you don't know. You don't know if you would like um your main entrance to be in the kitchen. No. See, that's that's all. Uh, the entrance. No, the first bedroom we went in that was small as hell. Yeah. That tiny. That's like I don't even know. That tiny. The second bedroom was a little bigger. Now the master's the it, it's good size. The master bathroom is small, but it's still good size. But the tub in the master bathroom is just too big. 
for the size of the bath the bathroom. A smaller tub or a standalone shower to make it look big. Because like how we like shower a lot more anyhow. And the hills and herds sink. The closet stays tiny. So I I mean into that closet space. That's a, like a problem for me. That, that doesn't need a lot of work. That need a lot of work. And I don't worth 180,000. No, no, no. I can see that going for 150, 140,000. Not 100. I'm not spending 180,000 and I have to do so much to it. Give me something less. That is, I don't know. I don't like, you know, no dining. I, no, I you, you see that small that dining room table no is? Dining, no dining and you barely could use all the chairs? I know, I know, um, entering, my main thing is entering through the kitchen, no dining area, and See, when, you know, we won't, we won't be able to entertain. I mean, you have the outside area, but yeah. when people come to your house, it, 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 the place is too clustered and jam up, man. There ain't enough for, uh, you know, friends coming over. No. Overall, that's a thumbs up or thumbs down. That's a thumbs down. Yeah. <laughs> on to the next one. Yeah, that's a thumbs down, <laughs> should, I must say. They should include a jet ski in the boat. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't even want a dirty ass boat. <laughs> no. Like, that's a thumbs down. Like, seriously? You selling me shit? A roofing problem? Please don't sell me shit. No boo. I I it's I spend money. I, I work hard for my money. And if I'm working hard for my money, I can't if I buy shit, it better be a low, low price that I could do a serious renovation on this whole thing. the Libre after all that bullshit we just see. <laughs> Ah, I can't believe you gotta sponsor me, honey. Sponsor me some rum. You know the Malin has like rum. I will get it. <laughs> I was really 